Hey guys, in this video, I will talk about the real-time API cost. You guys may already know I create a, a few demo about how to use the OpenAI real-time API. Uh, first one is for the Python plus the uh, Twilio, and iOS one, Android one, because all these three are very popular um, platform. After I have this done, I look back to my um, billing. Uh, which is uh, shocked me. Uh, it's cost me a lot. So I think it's time to talk about the price of the OpenAI uh, API, real-time API. Say if that is suit for your um, project. Okay, so let's talk about, uh, let's start from here. Let's start from the history billing. Let's take a look at my uh, billing page, uh, show you what to the price of the API. So uh, here is the, uh, at the very beginning, I use the default project. So this is my cost. Uh, actually, most of them are from the real-time API. You will see it's over here. Uh, after uh, October 5th, 50th, I switched to another project. I delete the, this one, delete this API key. I switch to over here. It still cost me a lot. So you will see it still uh, cost a lot. This one I built the iOS. So let me export this and give you some more clear view. So here I export that, uh, export the report. You can see I start the project from October 2nd. And uh, even I stop over here, I delete the key. I still get the charge uh, a little bit after that. So I believe they have some strategy to adjust the uh, billing or something. Uh, after that, um, this one, I mainly just build the uh, and uh, just build the Python and the iOS one. Uh, no, just the Python one. This one, I build the Android and iOS. So you will see for this three project i just uh, doing the debug and the test it uh, cost me around 434 dollars which are not so this may uh this i i really want to look into like what exactly uh charge me and how that get that high so I look into, I did another test uh, today. Um, I just uh, create one, uh, create a separate project and uh, do another um, three minutes calling, just to do another three minutes calling uh, with a brand new project, a brand new uh, API key uh, with my first uh, uh, demo. That demo just uses the, uh, um, use the Python plus the Twilio. So use this separate key, this brand new key to a uh, three minutes calling. So let's figure out how it will cost, how, um, how much it will uh, charge me. So, okay. So after three minutes call, I get back to my project and find this one so you will <laughs> see how much it will cost it's take around uh, two dollars 32 cents just for a three minutes call so okay it's turn out okay it's about uh, uh 78 cent per minute that's a lot that's i mean it's almost like a international call something okay so if we look back to the open ai announcement or their description for the price they talk about it's only need like six cents plus uh 24 cents but so totally it should be uh, uh it should be uh 13 cents per minute but actually is not actually is like twice higher it's even more than twice higher than they described so it's uh, just uh, 
you need to uh, keep in mind it may charge you uh, much more than you thought uh, this one is what they described so I dig into more detail why it charged me that much so if you look into I look into my uh, code I found that every like every one second it will post a payload to the server side even you don't speak it it will post something like so like this to the server side I think that may be the reason it will charge you a lot and each even it after a few milliseconds, it will send one pack. It will keep sending the pack to the server side. And each pack, I think each pack, uh, each word, like something like this, it will be one token. So that is why it will charge a lot. OK. I still don't think right now is a very good time to public your project or your app to everyone, because that will cost you a lot. But I still think it's a very good time to start building your project. Once the OpenAI gets the price done, you will get your project available immediately for everyone. That will save you a lot of time. Um, please subscribe my channel. I will uh, keep eyes on this subject. So once I get any updates, I will create more uh, content. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye.